remembering a young boy on what would have been his 13th birthday. A balloon release and candlelight vigil was held in honor of David Mack, family and several Atlanta leaders pledging to find his murderer. 11 Alive's Hope Ford shares more of their pleas for justice. Soon as my feet strike Zion, gonna lay down my heavy burden. Taking away children who should be around a birthday cake, singing happy birthday and opening up presents. Going home. A shudder of a father's shoulders, a young boy comforting his grandmother, a crowd solemn, shaken, heartbroken that another child in Metro Atlanta was taken away so viciously. This happens all too much. Help us find and bring the person or persons to justice. As the crowd sat for an hour, praying, trying to make sense of David Mack's murder, several Atlanta leaders pledged to help them find justice. There won't be any place for them to rest or lay their heads. They will be dealt with. But it wasn't just David everyone thought of, but all the recent senseless killings of children. 2021 will not be like 2020. I can't even begin to tell you how many students within my district that I had to say goodbye to. Over and over, a clear message was sent to the Mack family. You are not alone and help is here. And the city has grieved with you. And just days after this family buried a young boy, the pledges continue to pour in to help the family find peace and find the person who stole David from a life he hadn't yet begun to live. When a child is lost, you know, we all lose. Not just my child, not just our family. At the vigil, the family was presented with a check to help cover the expenses of David Mack's funeral. The $10,000 reward is still being offered for information about David's murder.